Hey guys, it's Nelson with Galaxy Note 2 Softmodder, and today I'm going to show you how to get iOS inspired application notifications on your Galaxy Note 2. So if you guys are converters from Apple to Android, then you, uh, you'll remember the notifications that appear on the right hand corner of each application whenever you receive a notification. Uh, that doesn't happen on Samsung, usually only happens maybe for uh, phone and messaging, email, stuff like that, but never for like Twitter, Facebook, and all the other uh, applications. So I'm going to show you how to add that. Uh, first thing you'll need to do is go to the Play Store. The application is called Notifier. Okay, so I'll just type in, okay, Notifier Unread Account. That's the full name of it. From there, uh, all you do is just open it up. Since I already have it installed, you guys are going to have to install it. So I'm going to open it and it'll take you to this. Uh, this is the only page really of the application. It's like a short tutorial. So step one says that Notifier must be enabled as an accessibility service. You can click here to do that. So you'll be taken automatically to your settings, accessibility, go to Notifier, and make sure that it's on. So well, now we'll go back. And step two is just adding a Notifier widget to your home screen. So the way you get these notifications are that your icons, something like this Twitter or Vine or Snapchat, they're gonna, you're going to take those off and you're going to replace them with a widget. So I'm just going to press on here. Whoops. Okay. Apps and widgets. I'll go to widgets. And I'm going to look for notifier. It's a one by one. It's a small one. And I'll add it here. And these are all the applications that you can create a widget for. So I'm going to use something like, uh, I'll use Instagram. And from there you can make it larger. Uh, I would make it a one by one because that would be probably the easiest thing. And from there you can also uh, change the settings because you can see that uh, there's no uh, it doesn't say Instagram under it, it's a bit larger than the other ones. So what you'll want to do is head over to Notifier. And you'll see all the current widgets that you have on there. I only have one. So the next thing I want to do is head over to the settings. From the settings you can change things such as uh, the style of the notification, um, the icon and all that stuff. And I'll show you guys really quick, I'll go through them as fast as I can. Uh, notification style, you can change the Little, not little notification that shows up on the right corner to be classic or the Samsung one which is the one that you guys are accustomed to. Um, you can go back, um, change the position of the notification anywhere you want. Um, that just changes it around the application. If it's down here it might show up like at the top middle so most people are accustomed to the top right so I think that's five. I'll leave it there. Notification size, I kept it small. Uh, icon size um, 125. I'll just keep it at 100% now. Um, change the position of it vertically because sometimes the widgets aren't aligned, so you have to change it with this. And hiding the label. You can either keep the label under that says Instagram or hide it. I'm going to keep it now. And that's it. So now I'll go back and you'll see here it is. And I also have my stock Instagram one, which is here. So you can get rid of that. And right now I'm going to send a notification so you guys can see how it pops up really quick. Let me sh uh, send one really quickly. Okay, I'm sending myself on Instagram uh, with my other Instagram account. <laughs> so we'll see right now. Sorry, it's taking so long. Should have been ready. Okay, so I set myself, and you can see it up there. And there you go. It's right there. It just says one since I just set myself one. And you can change that around in the settings. Like I said, you can keep it on this side, on the bottom, whatever, all that stuff. All right. Yeah. Well, thanks. That's it, guys. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and check out the full tutorial over at Galaxy Note 2 Softmodder. All right. Thanks.